If at any moment you know what you need to do, but you don't feel like it, just count backwards and let's just see what happens. And so I started using it, Steve, in this little count backwards technique, five, four, three, two, one. No idea why it's working, by the way. Um, in any moment, I'd see Chris, I'd want to kill him. Five, four, three, two, one. All of a sudden, I'm calm. I can speak to him from a more supportive place. Kids are irritating. Five, four, three, two, one. Take a breath. And now I can be the mom that I know I want to be. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm going out the door to exercise. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm picking up the phone and I'm networking. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm picking up the phone and calling my parents and asking for help. And slowly but surely, one decision at a time using the five second rule. And the five second rule is very simple. The moment you have an instinct to move, you got to do it within five seconds or your brain will kill it. And counting backwards is critical. I now know why it works. When you count backwards, five, four, three, two, one, you interrupt habit loops stored in your basal ganglia. And the counting backwards requires focus. So it awakens this sucker right here, your prefrontal cortex. It's referred to as a starting ritual in habit research, a cheat code for your brain. 